Last time we did Les Loups, that has the most elevation gain of any trail in this park, 447 meters. Today we are going to do uh, Le Scarpement because it has the second most elevation gain at 350 meters. And it's about 11 kilometers. Bonjour, today is Thursday, March 17th, and I am back at uh, Parc National de la Jacques Cartier to do, as I said, the escarpment trail, uh, Le Sentier L'Escarpement, because, so it's not the trail my friend Pete recommended I do, but the trail he recommended is only intermediate. So I'm sort of doing it in order of difficulty. I did the most difficult on Monday, Sentier Les Loups, and, uh, and when I say difficult, I mean um, elevation gain, most elevation gain. So I'm very excited. It's uh, lightly raining. It is calling for rain all day. I've got an umbrella. I'm not too worried about it. It's mild. It's um, one degree. Yeah, so let's get hiking. Right, I'm already down to a t-shirt. Um, the only reason I'm a bit nervous about that is because it is lightly raining. So that means I'm going to get my base layer wet. But I mean, anyway, that's fine. I have another merino wool shirt in my backpack. So if I need to put my jacket back on, I can just quickly take this off, put that on, and put my jacket on, which is also quickly getting wet. Anywho. point. I would just like to say that I'm dying of heat. Anytime it gets close to zero degrees, wearing a hat is too much. But I can't come off now. Maybe. So this is interesting, in this footprint, there's all these, I don't know what, and only in, like, it's not anywhere else on the trail. Hmm. 
And another one, exactly the same. So it is uh, 10.49. I've been hiking for one hour. I've hiked 3.8 kilometers. Yeah, that's about it. You know, it's just a very simple, scenic hike. It is rated difficult, but I think that's just due to the elevation. Like the path is, you know, very well groomed. No ropes or anything, like nothing like Les Loups. So, uh, yeah, anyway. Oh my goodness. Oh, people, runners. Anyway, uh, well, hmm. That's the end of this one, isn't it? So those runners were really nice. They came from a different direction. So I just asked them, I said, does the path continue that way? Or do I need to do an aller retour? And they said, it's supposed to be an aller retour, but you can go this way and it's just a little bit longer. So um, I am descending. I don't know what path this is, but different path. So it is 10 minutes to noon. I've been hiking for two hours. I've hiked 7.1 kilometers. Um, I don't even know if this is gonna make it to be a video because compared to Les Loups, it's quite, you know, it's just, it's lovely. It's lovely. So we shall see. Even the lookout point, you could see like a parking lot in the corner. So, you know, I don't know. So now this trail is basically parallel with the, uh, the road coming into the park. A car just passed. Mm -hmm.
really don't know if I'm going to make this into a video. Um, however, if I do, I would just like to say that if you come to Parc National de la Jacques Cartier and you can only do one trail, I would say du les loups. Um, most elevation gain, beautiful lookouts, um, interesting like terrain and yeah, it was amazing. This trail was a nice walk. So yeah, anywho, thank you very much for watching. Please continue to watch, comment, like, and subscribe. Keep my retirement dream alive of doing adventures in nature full time when I retire in 12 years and one month. See you in the next video. Thank you.